यो मतलब गाइस थोड़ा मैं शो यू स्क्रैच लैब सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड तो स्क्रैच लैब इज अ न्यू थिंग स्क्रैच इंट्रोड्यूस टुडे आई थिंक एंड दिस वाज इंट्रोड्यूस बाय पीएसवाईटी ऑन आर डिस्कॉर्ड सो थैंक्स फॉर दैट पीएसवाईटी एंड यू यू हैव थिंग्स लाइक एनिमेटेड टेक्स्ट यू कैन जस्ट पुट इफेक्ट्स टू द टेक्स्ट डायरेक्टली विदाउट एनी कॉस्ट्यूम्स और थिंग्स एंड देन वी हैव फेस डिटेक्शन एंड फेस सेंसिंग ब्लॉक लाइक गो टू नोज यू कैन सी दिस इज एन एग्जाम्पल फॉर दैट सो दिस इज जस्ट लाइक एक्सपेरिमेंटल ब्लॉक्स दीज आर नॉट इन स्क्रैच येट बट इफ द स्क्रैच लाइक दिस इट विल बी इन स्क्रैच so let's start it so first of all we have animated text blocks click on try it out click on try it out to get to this page i'll put the link in the description you can just check that out or you can just go to scratch.mit.edu and then you can just click on introducing scratch lab or you can just search it so here we have things like these so you can see we have show text text welcome to my project so let's see what it does here you can see this show text but on the screen no sprite is created and our sprite is deleted or hidden below it so let's delete our sprite and just do it with backdrop so here you can see this still shows up so this is not a very good sign it should be in sprite or something or it should be sync with this text like looks text like speaking text or other text so here we have rainbow effect like here we go here you can see we have it in rainbow and then you can just put your type these are awesome features and i'll put it forever so it types it if you put it single here you can see this is very good then we have zoom so here you can see this is not working zoom doesn't work on backdrop so let's make a sprite and now put here zoom here we go so here you can see this works and the x and y positions are still working on it like here you can see we have x and y 0 and now it works if i said x 200 it will go there so this is working very great so then we have show sprite i don't know what this will do show sprite or hide sprite if i hide this sprite it will not show it so what it does i don't know exactly then we have set font si font to pixel or anything we have these fonts so let's set it to sans serif the best font then we have show text welcome to my project instead hello so let's see so this is in sans serif it's working great so this is good then we have set text color so i will put here red and let's see what it works like so this is looking good then we have set with 200 aligned left so let's see what it does like center i will put here right let's try with right so this is aligned very nice this feature was really required in scratch like for thumbnails and things so let's try them all together so like show text hello hello and this should be in zoom so instead we'll put this block hello everyone and this should be in zoom then we should like have it in type so we have this like hello welcome to scratch world 2021 this right text align is not uh, looking good so let's just put it here center and let's see now hello welcome to scratch world 2021 this is looking good and we need text color to say purple or dark purple and we want font like first of all the pixel one this will look good let's see and put here when the green flag clicked hello welcome to scratch world 2021 so this is looking very great so let's try the another feature they introduced so this is face sensing blocks try it out try it out so as you can see this detects my face and turns on my camera i won't do my face reveal in a tutorial video so this is like I have increased the size for now, so we can still work with it. So yeah, you can see these blocks are very really awesome. Like go to nose, so go to nose, and now we'll see it. Let's see. So it goes to nose. So I'll put here between eyes, so it is just on my face or top of head. So this is better, I think. Then you can also have point and direction of face tilt. So if I tilt my face a bit, then it will just tilt it with my face. You can also put it in forever loop like this. So yeah, you can see if I tilt my face, it will tilt it with me. Even when I speak, my face is tilted. I think so. It is just doing like that. And also good or between eyes. So this is like face tracking, and this is really good. You can also put glasses if you like, and multiple sprites. This might be heavy for some PCs, but this is great for me. Then when the face tilts left or right, so this is the detection block. Let's see if it works. Like start sound meow. So this works great. Like here you can see. 
and if I put it left, this is looking very really great. I didn't expect it from experimental blocks, but this is working really great. Great. It also has like when the sprite touches a nose, so you can just put it anything like this. So it between the between eyes. So yeah, you can see this is already here, so it will just loop it forever. So let's see it works or not. See, say hello. You can see this is saying hello now. If I start like here, you can see this is now saying hello forever because it is between my eyes, and this is running the project because it is always working so you can just remove it and also this so to stop the script then when a face is detected so it will obviously do anything when my face is detected and you cannot stop this because the camera is always on and like the project will be always on so you can just remove it if you don't want that a face is detected this will just show me if it is true or false so if i just cover my camera you can see this is false and if i remove it it will be true so this is really great. Scratches improved a lot in terms of camera. Face tilt, it will just tell me my face tilt. So it can detect it from here. Then we have face size. It's a huge number like 200. So this was all for this tutorial. You can give it feedback. This was a really good thing. So these are the only two things for now by Scratch Lab. We can expect more from Scratch. So let's see how it works. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe for more content like this. So thank you.